Hello programmers, welcome back to my channel. First of all, this tutorial is made in Swift 4 on Xcode 9, but if you are still using Swift 3, then this should work fine for you. So today we will learn how to unwind Segway. So let's get started. Here I have already created a layout. I have three view controllers with buttons on them. So let's quickly perform Segway so that we can unwind them. So I will start performing segue so go to will be show and go to three will be show and so let's quickly run this application so go to two go to three and it's working so this is cancel button what this cancel button will do is this cancel button will take us directly to our first view controller okay the gray one is our first view controller so I'll so you will say that let's just do this so I will just put it over here and you will say just let's say con uh, control drag from cancel to our first view controller and say show okay so I will quickly run the app and it does serve your situation but it's wrong I will tell you I will show you why so go to two go to three go to three go to cancel and see uh, notice view controller is coming from bottom so go to two, go to three and cancel. Okay, uh, when we press cancel, the same transition happens. So, so just go back to your Xcode and click on this, which is debug view hierarchy and select that. So your application will stop, but when you just twist it, you will see the amount of view controllers in your like uh, background so if you have a like very big application you cannot do this this will create an overhead so I will show you the right way of doing it so let's stop the application and go to view controller first of all right click on cancel and uh, deselect this one so now what we uh, now what we will be doing is we will be unwinding the segue so go to your target view controllers uh, view uh, swift file so for our project our target view controller is our uh, main view controller so i will select the view controller and i already have the view controller file which is the preloaded one so under that just type in at id action it will be func unwind and uh, you can test it out that you did it right or not so what we will be basically doing is we will be selecting this cancel button and control drag to this red button which is our exit button so this is our exit button and we will control drag currently it's not working so it will work once we create the method so it will be at ib action func unwind segue and just type in underscore and sender and sender will be ui storyboard segue and just create this for now and if you go back just save this so command save and under main.storyboard you can select this cancel button and drag it over to this exit button as you can see it turns blue this time and you can select the method we just created so it works okay so now you can do like say first of all print this is unwinding and just say okay and let's run the application so this time it should work say go to two go to three and cancel so notice this go to two go to three uh, the the view controller comes from bottom and when we press cancel it comes from top so and let's do it a few more times so okay so now we go uh, if we go back to this uh, debug view hierarchy you can see that there is only one view controller so that's a right way of going back to your main view controller once you are done doing the stuff in between so this is unwinding of segue thank you guys keep watching and don't forget to subscribe for further videos